Hi, my name is Dave Andrews. Today I'm going to show you how to compare laptop computers. Now one thing that you're going to look for when you're looking at a new uh, laptop in the store, the one thing that's going to pop out to you more than anything is the physical size of the laptop. Now uh, basically this is usually determined by the screen size. So if somebody says that you have a 17 inch laptop, they're referring to the size of the screen on that laptop. Now, as you can tell, the size of the screen is going to dictate the dimensions of the rest of the laptop. That can dictate the size of the keyboard, that can dictate the size of the mouse pad, uh, your controls that you'll have up here at the top of the laptop. That's all going to be determined by the overall size of the laptop. Now, another thing to consider when looking at the laptop, is if I hold this up here for you, is this one in particular has uh, media controls. Now this is actually a uh, Pavilion Media PC, entertainment PC, and it's meant to be um, hooked up to a uh, basically a television where you can watch TV and DVDs uh, from your laptop. So that's one thing you want to consider if that's what you're looking for is the type of media controls that the laptop has. Uh, another thing is um, does it have a wireless connection? Most laptops nowadays do. Some of them even come with built-in cellular connections. So you want to ask about that when you're looking for a laptop. Uh, now they make them what are called now netbooks, which are actually gaining a lot of popularity among business users. They are ultra portable laptops. Like this, a netbook may only be this big compared to my laptop that I have here. Uh, now the downsides to a netbook are they have less storage space. Uh, they don't have a CD drive. Uh, but the benefits are um, they're ultra portable. You can carry them. They only weigh about two pounds. Uh, you can put them in a backpack. Um, and also they have built-in wireless and they're supposed to be used basically to access your business's websites and files uh, wirelessly. So if you're looking for you know, a business laptop that you're going to carry and travel around quite a bit, you might want to consider one of those. My name is Dave Andrews, and I've just talked to you a little bit about what to look for when purchasing a laptop.